The atmosphere in King's Court was unbelievable. They'd play a song, you'd come out of the bullpen. The King's Court would be freaking out. It was always the start of something special. You can tell everybody. I'm the man, I'm the man, I'm the man. Yes, I am, yes, I am, yes, I am. That's what it would start. Fans down at King's Court already on their feet. Got the yellow K cards. Fans in that section knew they were coming for nine innings and they were going to give everything they had. 12 sections, 14 sections, 20 sections, bring in the 300 level. You're the lords and the ladies of royalty. Honestly, I felt like the crowd was just like feeding off of Felix. Nowhere in any other ballpark came close to the rabidness of the fans in the King's Court. Big strikeout, big out, he would always kind of hit his chest. Point at us. You just feel that energy and that appreciation. It wanted you to scream louder. It wanted you to cheer harder. Watching him pitch with, with the passion that he pitched with the electricity. That entire crowd was so locked in every single pitch. For years when I sat in the King's Court, I wanted the turkey leg. I do my little wave motion here and there. He just, you know, give us a little shimmy. When you would finally find that one person, they would be so excited. They're uh, having a good time in the left field corner tonight. I've met so many great Mariners fans sitting out in the King's Court. Definitely was a community in King's Court, no matter who you were there with. A lot of screaming. Like, at the top of your lungs, Kay. Like, you're leaving this ballpark without a voice, Kay. Kay, 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 Kay. And the King's Court making some noise out there. There was no one like Felix on the mound. Just Seven shutout innings came off the mound, emphatically shouted, this is my house. This is my house. Every five days, that was what you tuned in for was to watch Felix. Swing and a miss. He got a strike three and it's over. No moment was too big for him. That day in August was an incredible day. I think the person who realized it first might have been my wife. I may have nudged him, kind of, and was like, oh, look at the scoreboard, like this is crazy. I turn the radio on and hear that Felix has got a no-hitter going. 15 in a row, retired by Felix. Parked the car, jogged to the ballpark. You just feel the kinetic energy in the Kings Court, in the stadium. 2-2! Two, two. He got it! To be honest, I don't even think I looked at my husband. I was just so excited. I was just screaming at the top of my lungs. It was bedlam, so I'm so glad I was there. Oh yeah, lots of tears at Felix's last game. There are moments that you will never forget, and this is one of them. We were all holding up the thanks K cards in the King's Court. This is gonna be it. He's gonna take his final bow right now. I think it's a connection unlike any I've had with any other professional athlete. The love and emotion for a player who gave his heart to this city, to this organization. I'm right there. I really didn't expect to be in the shot at all. This is one I'm gonna keep for the rest of my life, for sure. He was just so loyal to this city and that's why I love him so much. For his entire career, Felix was ours. The fact that we had watched him grow up as we grew up, really kind of forges a connection with the player. You know, as soon as you say Felix, everybody knows who you're talking about. He absolutely was the man. Felix, you're the reason I'm a Mariners fan. We just appreciate everything you've done. You were the star. Words can't describe how much you mean to this city, this fan base. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. We just want to say thank you because you really meant a lot to us. He gave everything he possibly could give until there was no more to give.